Good news, Pastor Wendy. Good news? Yes, good Easter news. Easter is here? Well, not that good. Oh, okay. It's the last Sunday in Lent. <laughs> well, we're getting closer. But this is the hardest week yet. Oh, I 100% agree. I've been looking at this story of Mary, Martha, and Lazarus. Jesus is with his disciples when he receives word that his close friend Lazarus is sleeping, as he puts it. The disciples don't really get it, but he's dead. And everybody's thrown into this just overwhelming grief. Yeah, well, death is hard. Grief is hard. It's one of the hardest parts of our life to understand that, especially when you love someone. Mm -hmm. That's what our book this week is, I Still Believe, by Jeremy Camp. It's his memoir about his life when he was early in his career and he met a woman named Melissa that he deeply fell in love with, only to find out that she had cancer. Mm -hmm. And so it's their battle and their their journey with this cancer. and. It's like a roller, an emotional roller coaster that they go on. Um, and, and in this story, um, they face death. Only unlike Lazarus, Jesus doesn't bring her back. And I think that's the hardest part for us, is that when we have loved ones that we love so dearly and we want them to be like Lazarus and for God to give them back to us. Well, and, and that is so true. The story of Lazarus reminds us that, yes, Jesus is there, present in the midst of our suffering. Jesus even weeps with us. And we get this glimpse in Lazarus' rising that he lives again, only to realize, when we're really honest about it, he has to face death yet again, too. And, and really, the good news is that Jesus is there with us. I and the promise right. is that Jesus, in his death and resurrection, reminds us death is never forever. Right, I guess you're right. The one part of life is that we all have to die. Even Jesus had to die. But it doesn't end there. It doesn't end there. And so thankfully, we will get to Easter. Thank but the good news is, <laughs> Lent's almost finished, and Holy Week and Easter are almost here. Almost. So join us this last week of our Lenten season as we face the pain of the cross, but we also realize the hope and the promise that comes from our Savior. We'll see you on Sunday as we celebrate the good news together. See you then.